Welcome back to the channel guys. Today he joins us at Dewsbury and District Golf Club with James Ward, the head pro here, where we're going to be having a 5 hole vlog. I can't wait for this, Jim. I've never played here before. You know, never. You know, greens look awesome. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. It's in good nick at the moment. Um, bit of rain over the weekend, so they're yeah. quite acceptable. So It's going to yeah. be a tough match this. You always do quite well in, in district events, don't you? Not too bad, not too bad. So uh, we're going to give him a game. It's going to be a little bit harder than playing James Robinson. We're going to give it a, a good shot. So uh, I'll let you show us the way. Right, okay, mate. Dull, 351 a... yards, par four, uphill. I think it's driver. Straight out, it sounds good. Solid drive. Take that shot. Just better get my driver out. Oh, four right! Yeah. Can you find it over there? Yeah, yeah. Just on 17th fairway, mate. Yeah, there it is. Dylan. Right, so a little bit out of position to start. We've got about 140 yards uphill. It's quite a steep incline, this. I'm going to go eight iron. It looks like there's nothing for right. It's at it. I don't know if it's going to have legs, but looks good. it's looking all right. Yeah, that's, that's good, mate. Yeah. So James looks probably like he's got about 70 yards in. So the idea of these vlogs, guys, is to get to know a little bit about the pros and, you know, on and off the course and uh, to check out the golf and the golf club that they're at, which I must say this Jewsbury Golf Club looks stunning so far. Oh, it could be left. Ooh. Pulled it a touch. I think we're about the same. First thing I noticed when I got here, James, were how quick these greens look. They do look really yeah. good. They look, uh, they're pretty good at minute. And then if you, if you like the wrong side, like uh, like I could be here, it's uh, it quite tricky to stop it. Yeah. Bit shy. Okay, a bit of meat on that. Come on, come on. It does take energy out a little yeah. bit because you're going uphill. Well done. You definitely made yeah. this look a little bit longer with that putt. Oh, nightmare. Oh dear. A little slider. Went a bit firm. Ideal start against this lad. You don't make many mistakes. We try not to. <laughs> Second hole, par four, 338 yards up hill. It's stroke five. It looks a lot longer. It's going to play tough, this one. Good shot. Didn't actually see that. Lost it in some, but it felt all right. Get up. It's gonna we'll be a, work, mate. It's gonna be a long way in. So I've just rolled out into semi. I've got 150 yards uphill. Probably gonna play a club more, I think, today. Yeah, that's nice. It's looking like being green anyway. Hopefully I can yep, safely on mate. Good not shot. free put this time. <laughs> So I've 106 to flag. 106. 106, and there's, this is a shot here, this, where it catches a lot of people out if you've not played it, because you're about, you know, we've got a big climb. Yeah. Winds into face, so it's 106. It could well, be. Well, people might have been thinking, well, three, three, six yards, how can that be stroke five? Yeah, but yeah. Uphill, I mean, you can tell by the length for our shots off the tee, um, it really does take it out of the driver and, or, you know, out of your tee shot. 
camp, you know, you don't want to be in that bunker that's just short. That is a deep massive thing. incline. For a little uh, 50 degree, just try and punch it a little bit, I think. I'm on a bit of an upslope as well, yeah. Come on, Jimmy. Lovely shot. It's just turning over a little bit. Just pulling it, that's me all over. Oh, Ooh, it's come up short. I think you'll be able to appreciate it, guys. Even mine's not got up, but look at that incline. So if you can really get that perception from here, it's so steep. Where I thought mine had got up on the green, struck it really well. Even I'm sure. We've got a 30 okay. second tip from James coming up as well, which will be worth sticking around for. I'm trying to get all pros that we visit to give us a little tip to help you guys improve your golf. Fantastic shot. Oh, I like it. I like it. You short money? You what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mate, a bit skint this week. <laughs> right, this has made this uh, a little more difficult. Come on, I can't afford to leak too many shots around green. Oh, dear. This could end up turning into a free old vlog. <laughs> we will actually play five. Be positive, come on, ram it in. Yeah, Just. good put, mate. Good needed pump. that. Well done. Afternoon fours. Good at for that. Third hole, 438 yards, but this one is extremely downhill. <laughs> We're going back to where we've come from. It's like quite a lot of rough ground to get over. And there's fairways down there. So I've got a big question for you, James. Have you got any red flags? Um, I'd say probably my biggest red flag, uh, flag is being a Leeds fan. You're a Leeds fan? Yeah, oh, yeah. no. They'll all be switching off now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, That's dear. It. How's that come about? Uh, my dad. You spot yeah. dad, your dad's dad. Been, yeah, dad's been a Leeds fan since he was a kid. So I went to my first match in 1998. It started to look a bit good up to 2002, and then it's just been down 11. Right, since, I better so. pull my finger out now. I can't, yeah. lose, I can't lose to a Leeds fan. Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> Lovely. Good shot. Do you play much golf? So it should kick. Uh, yeah, I do, to be fair, mate, yeah. Played proms last few weeks, actually. So. You'll know, probably say it balls most days. Yeah. I practice keep going this is what i'm obviously what guys on youtube probably don't know is i've dropped part-time at work so i'm doing three days at club now right and these videos that i'm doing playing with you guys obviously to get to know about you and meet some at pros you know at different clubs and stuff but also i really want to get my golf back to playing standard yeah. so i think it's kind of it's good um to give me some regular golf and obviously hopefully inspire me to practice a bit more Oh, nice. That's better. Perfect. Yeah, that's landed in middle. What's your best 30 second tip for the subscribers at home? So, my tip for it can be every golfer of all age, at all stages. Um, I, when I'm giving lessons, what a lot of lot I see from my coaching is people finishing the swing on, with weight on this right foot. And it's my one tip would be finish the swing all the way around onto your left foot. That's the only swing foot I have when I'm playing, is just think about my finishing position and my weight. Looking like looking a pro like at the there. end. Yeah, looking what you see, yeah. Just talking to James there off camera. James plays a lot more golf than I do. He's playing a lot of proms and stuff. And we're talking about 
you know, I've really struggled with my driver over the last couple of years, and you clearly are a good driver at ball, aren't you? I am, yeah, and usually. And um, what be... James was saying is, is he he's a bit feels like tunnel vision with a driver. Like if you're at a bowling alley, and you've got barriers at each side. It feels like he's, you know, you... At the, yeah. At the minute, I just feel like I can stand there and hit it wherever wherever someone says to hit it. And what I was saying is, I get that feeling up to about a free iron, and after a free iron, I lose that. I feel as yeah. though there's no barrier to how wide it can go. Yeah, yeah. And that's why I always revert back to it in a like a shorter iron. Uh, one seven four down. Well, one seven four. Yeah. Oh no! I pushed it. Miss that bunker. No, it's in it. Having said that, it Actually, might be better being in yeah, it. Yeah, I think you probably will, mate. It stopped it there. Right, big drive that, James. 90 yards left. 90 yards. Funny, funny, funny little light. It's like downhill, ball above my feet. So I could, could move it a bit left. A bit down. I've got my 58. Let's see if we can get it dancing. Lovely strike. Come on then. Oh, that had some zig on it. It was a bit stopped. Stopped quick, didn't it? Right, I need the hands are sevy here, I think. On, roll out. Great shot, mate. We're trying. We're trying to hang on against a very finely tuned golf pro, Mr. Ward. A little bit of aim point. Yeah, I like to use it. Taught yeah. by uh, your mate, James. Oh, did James yeah. teach you? Yeah, yeah, but uh, but fixed me. Funny enough, he hadn't taught me. <laughs> <laughs> I did that from you. What are you thinking? <laughs> what? <laughs> what about honourable half? Friendly half? Yeah, good, yeah, good. Yeah. yeah, go on then. Fourth all, par four, 353 yards uphill. It's a stunning little hole with a... I reckon we're going to need to lay up and then hit a sort of 130, 140 yard shot in. And James has got the iron out. Is yeah, he trying yeah. to protect his one one nil lead? <laughs> Diff going defensive. Hold it. Okay, bit out of position. It could be gone that. It could be reloaded. Unless it's been rescued. You know what? After Double seeing night. yours take that bad bounce, it scared me a bit. That it left hand side at fairway, guys, you know, if you catch sort of towards the tree, it does take an awful kick left. To play another, I, d I don't think it'll have stayed in that. Though. Just hung it out right there after that. Good strike. Just the contours, isn't it? This is a good yeah. rules test for you guys. James finish on the path. If you can just see his ball there, it's on the left half of the path. I know where most members would want to drop it at our golf club. Yeah. Well, not our golf club, but most members' golf clubs. But it's actually to the left hand side. Yeah, it's the we've just been saying it here on our little rules night we had, it's the nearest, not the nicest. Yeah. Which is just a shame here because um it wouldn't be nice to put it there, but what your vision in then? I think well, I think I'm just going to go straight straight under that tree. Yeah. And if I catch it good enough, it yeah. could run up. Definitely. There's a bit of help up that hill towards towards the green. 
it's not too bad. I think at least you can make a swing, can't you? Yeah, you can get a full swing at it. Let's go a bit lower. Come on then. Oh, steady. Wow. Is that good for pace? Could be. Could be. If it's just slowed it up enough. But even then there's a it goes up, it could go up the back and back down. Needed that, a bit of magic. That's not a shot you practice every day, is it? No, no, that's just pure imagination. Pure imagination <laughs> and feel. Yeah. Right, so we're not sure where James is yet, but it did look really good. I've got a feeling it could be sneaky close. So 177 uphill, I've got six iron. There's a lot, quite a lot of elevation, but I just don't think I could hit a five iron and, and really commit to it. So is there much room right, James? Yeah, you've got a bit, yeah, yeah. Oh no, I pulled it. That's terrible. What an idiot. Oh, too much. Come down. Trying. Not a bad effort. That was a great shot from where you were, James. Yeah, nice uh, recovery. Thanks, mate. So just a little awkward one. He's not going to take good, good now. <laughs> good shot. Okay, mate. Let's move that back. You can have that, bud. You sure, yeah? Yeah. Thank you, mate. Congratulations, James. Thank you, mate. I've loved Thank coming you. here today, and I'm, I'm actually going to come back and play the rest of the course because I've, I've loved what I've seen, and obviously it's not too far from what I feel. It's only 15 yeah. minutes. But we're going to play the last hole, the signature hole here, the 14th hole, and, and what did you just say about this, this hole? So it's a, it's a card wreck. It's a great hole, as you can see. So there's a drop. We've got a plateau that you can sort of lay up to... There's been everything from eagles to, well, as high as you can go, really. <laughs> yeah. It's a proper card. Is, is that wrecker. the green right at the bottom? Yeah, that's it. With yeah. the two bunkers? Yeah, so it's about 420 yard. Yeah. Obviously, it doesn't play that because you're going down, but. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Anything could happen. <laughs> Both sides. <laughs> right, James is opting for driver. Um, I'm going to try not and get the world's highest score ever, so I'm going for iron. Because <laughs> <laughs> the way I'm playing, it's quite impossible. <laughs> Yeah. It's down the left. Tad left? Yeah. Is there any bail out there? No, that's... Could be a bit tight, that. The bail out's sort of right, actually. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, perfect. It's not the... Most exciting shot in the world, but it's down the middle. Yeah, done the job. Nice. Well, that were an absolutely stunning tee shot, and we've got downhill 124 yards. I must say, this is probably the most undulated course that I've played in a long time. The nearest I could say I've played to this in, in recent years is probably Stocksbridge and, um, and Halifax Hogden. Uh, both, you know, equally as contoured, but I weren't, it's a surprise because it does make you really think about, you know, this could be a two club length drop, I think. It's 125 yards. I don't think I can get anything more than a 54. Yeah. I'm just saying on camera there, I've not played a course this undulated for ages. Yeah. This is, yeah. And I'm having this to even like defense, really, yeah. stand, yeah. like slope my shoulders down the slope and stuff like that, which. I haven't done that for a long time. I felt like I've like hit down the slope. Get over. Looks good. Yeah, yeah safely on, mate. Nice shot. Right, I'd like to see you get out of this one, James. Well, 
We'll uh, try and find some magic. I mate. don't even think Sevy could get out of this one. <laughs> Maybe turn a wedge in and go through that gap yeah, with a bit of draw. That's the sort of only way. Can't go over it. You gotta you gotta punch it, but you don't want it going uh too fast. So I'm gonna go for my pitching wedge and just try and because it's downhill, it's already got the sort of speed. Oh, if it misses that bunk, I'll tell you what, that's a great effort. Steady now. Steady now, steady. Steady. Oh. Yeah, see, just too much speed. It's settled down just over the top. Guys, if you're passing through Murfield, it's about 15 minutes from Uddersfield, you've got to come and check this course out. We were just saying there off camera that it does really test your ability and, uh, you know, ability to assess lies, doesn't it? Because you're not going to get yeah, too you, many yeah. flat lies no. around here. There's a lot of awkward lies and that's its biggest sort of defence. Um, you've got to really learn and go and go and find that shot from a practice area or something and just just practice it. I think anybody that can play around here, that they'll have every shot in the bag to play everywhere, won't they? Once you've been around here. I've hit shots today that I've never hit for, well, for years. A bit of pace, go on, go. Not bad. Here we've got a chance to win a hole off him. <laughs> <laughs> Come down. Ooh. Yeah, good put, mate. I'll give you that. Solid. Well done. Cheers, mate. James, I've really enjoyed coming up here yes, today. Me too, mate. I'm thank definitely going to be back yeah. up again. I might yeah, even bring you. some of my mates up for a game. Yeah. Um, well, we're going to be going in shop, aren't we now? Yeah, we're going to the pro shop and see what we've got. So on the channel at the minute, not only were we meeting and trying to beat the pros, that didn't end well, <laughs> uh, we're going to be doing a bit of a UK bargain hunt, going around pro shops to see if there's any hidden gems in there. Now, I've seen something that I think the subscribers are going to like. We're going to post that video in a couple of days' time, guys, so make sure you subscribe, watch out for that one, and we'll see what bargains you've yeah. got. It's actually a stunning shop you've got. It's nice, isn't it? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah it's really good. We try hard every day to... Yeah, make it look good, fill it with latest gear. So I've took a few yeah. ideas as well to try and take back to Huddersfield. Yeah, yeah. I love it. your shoe yeah. display. Yeah, it's nice. Shoe it has got a special. Yeah, yeah the hat yeah. display. I think Alex is going to yeah. like that one. Guys, I hope you're enjoying the videos. Get in the comments if there's anything you want us to do. Um, and make sure you check James out as well. Drop your social media platforms in there. And lessons yeah. wise, I might even come back and have a driving lesson after what I've seen today. Seen him, yeah. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Yeah. We'll see you in a few days' time. Bye.